There are numerous projects for alleviating economic crisis worldwide, with great resource envelopes and great reach in terms of beneficiaries. The project, limiting the effect of the economic crisis in the north of Montenegro, is relatively small in terms of budget, but has an exceptional impact in the context of the small country of Montenegro. The government, the institutions, were under tremendous uh, financial crunch and, and stress. Therefore, very often, there were not enough either resources or capacities to move ahead with some tasks which are extremely important for the, for the state at this, at this moment. And then we jump in uh, together with the, uh, with the government, of course, and helped with very quick, very immediate um, expert advisory support in several areas. I would specifically mention the uh, elaboration of the um, uh, regional development strategy which is extremely, extremely important for Montenegro where we have the regional disparities in terms of economic and social development, specifically development of the north. The goal of this project was to support entrepreneurs in five municipalities in the north of the country with good business ideas with a specific emphasis on women. The support consisted of trainings, education and grants ranging between 3,000 and 8,000 euros. Priority was not necessarily given to the poorest, but to those with the best business plans and supply chains. To su projekti koji imaju više struke koristi. Prvo, o, omogućava se direktna valorizacija raspoloživih resursa i potencijala, naročito u lokalnim zajednicama koje su bogate resursima, a opet su paradoksalno nerazvijene, što je slučaj znači sa sjevernim dijelom Crne Gore. Drugo, omogućava se kreiranje novih radnih mjesta, razvijenje porodičnih i održivih biznisa. Treće, doprinosi se povećanju kvaliteta života na lokalnom, a tim i nacionalnom nivou. In the first phase, the United Nations Development Program provided technical training on developing an idea into a functioning business plan. Representatives of the UNDP, local municipalities, the National Directorate for Development of SMEs, and the Business Startup Center in the city of Bar selected the best 12 plans that qualified to receive financial and mentoring support from UNDP. UNDP supported the winning candidates through the official procedure of registering their business and obtaining the necessary licenses for the start of operations. The field of expertise for the 12 startups ranged from production of souvenirs and handicrafts, to setting up river rafting for tourists, to organic food production, horticulture, greenhouse production of vegetables and flowers, and the buying and processing of forest fruits and mushrooms. One year hence, the 12 winning businesses are still operating and we hope that in the next year to 18 months, UNDP will continue supporting these businesses. Priority was given to ideas pertaining to green jobs, which could be linked with local tourism initiatives. The empowerment of women was promoted through special support to women entrepreneurs. While entrepreneurial development initiatives have been attempted many times in the past, a general weakness has often been the long-term support. A new entrepreneur has sometimes been able to start only to see the business come to a halt some months later due to unforeseen problems for which there is no support. Vršimo preradu tih šumskih plodova i već je došlo do promjene u mom životu. Evo dobila sam tu komoru, znači mogu mnogo više da proširim posao. Konkurisao sam i uradio sam biznis plan. Ja sam tražio konkretnu mašinu, vlasarsku gravericu za izradu, sječenje, graviranje u svim materijalima. Bavim se domaćom radinošću, onaj ručnim radovima, heklani, mašinski. 16 godina sam na birou, a za moju porodicu ovo da znači mnogo, jer do ovoga može da se živi. Onda su mi pomogli ovom mašinom, laptopom, koncem. Bavim se raftingom i kampovanjem i izdavanjem smjestajnih kapaciteta. Ove kućice sam dobio kao donaciju ili grant što će donijeti i dohodke za sve nas i za okolinu. Perspektiva i mogućnosti ovog kraja su velike, s tim što treba dosta rada. Ja ostajem, a preporučujem ostalima. Imamo plastenik i u njega proizvodimo trenutno kornišon. Nadam se da će za godinu, dvije već možda to i proširiti, ako već to bude išlo kako treba. Da se ne nadam da će biti dobro, ne bi uopšte počinjala sve to da radim. Za hvilju jednu piju sam dobio ovaj kultivator sa svim dodatnim priključcima, sistem za navodnjavanje ka po kap i sve to što ide cisterne i sve, da ne bi nosio kantu da zalivam. Mnogo mi je lakše i obrađivati, frezati oko ovih jabuka, da ne frezam ručno. Nadam se jednoj 
egzistenciji finoj za mene i za moju porodicu. These men and women have succeeded in starting up successful small businesses employing between 1 and 15 employees and with relatively wide-reaching networks of suppliers, transportation and storage, hence benefiting others in their communities. Most importantly, however, these 12 businesses have served as test cases. Through their establishment, UNDP was able to record and address the challenges and obstacles the entrepreneurs faced. These lessons have gone into developing the legal and policy frameworks for entrepreneurship development, a system which is now in place. This is a very significant step for the north of Montenegro. The region now has the ability to support the development of small enterprises from training to employment, allowing for flexible pre-employment and training services, mentoring and retention support, and supporting unemployed people through longer-term career development. It is planned that the larger vision for the north of the country, one of grassroots, sustainable tourism and small green businesses, will be supported by wider ranging initiatives started by local governments, hence starting a cascade effect. This project is a success story which is still being written. Only longer term economic performance indicators can reveal the true impact of the initiative. However, for local government officials, small business owners, their employees, family members and neighbours, the verdict is clear. This project has already been instrumental in creating the framework for future entrepreneurial success in their communities. <laughs>